Hello everybody, I have Kelly Finn with me today, one of our personal lines account managers here at TDA. And she's gonna tell a story of someone she knows and it does a really good job of explaining why you should have the unlimited option for your personal injury protection on your auto insurance. So I'm gonna let Kelly take it away here and tell her story. When I was in high school, I had a friend of mine who was driving and she got in a terrible car accident and she was actually injured from the neck down. She is now confined to a wheelchair, and what I can tell you is that her life would not be the same had she not had the unlimited lifetime benefit that is provided through Michigan Auto Insurance. Um, all of her needs are met. Her home that she currently lives in, lives in independently, has been modified to suit her needs. The vehicle that she currently uses has been modified to fit her needs. She has 24-7 attendant care to assist her, again, with all of her needs. And these are very valuable coverages that you don't have through your personal health insurance. And this is the point that I'm trying to make to each client when I discuss PIP reform on the phone. I like to touch on this story because I know her life would not be the same had she not had this coverage. And I know as as part of the younger generation, I'm, I'm only 30 years old, I have a whole life ahead of me. And so the value of that coverage is uncomparable. And for me to, just for instance, for my own policy and my own vehicle, I would only be saving $25 a month had I, on, had I opt out of the PIP coverage, the now, the new option that I'm allowed to do. And that savings does not outweigh the benefit of that lifetime unlimited coverage that I'll have. I have a lot of life to live, and again, there's just a lot of value in that unlimited PIP coverage. And I don't think that people realize what they are sacrificing, and that's what I like to touch on. The attendant care, the home and vehicle modifications, and then aside from that, you're subject to your personal health insurance limitations. Um, you know, say you only have 20 rehabilitation visits that are available on your personal health insurance policy. Well, then you're subject to your co-insurance until your deductible is met. And like many people, I never meet my deductible and it's only $1,500. And so if I were to get in one accident and need one CAT scan, I would be subject to my deductible and all of the savings that I would have had through opting out of PIP coverage or even reducing would have been completely negated by the payment that I would need to make out of pocket for that CAT scan because I have not met my personal health insurance deductible. So there's just a lot of things to consider before you make a change with your PIP coverage through your auto policy. I think Kelly did a really great job of explaining why you need to have the unlimited PIP and get it, did a good job of giving examples of what you're missing out on if you rely solely on your health insurance. So if you wanna talk further about your personal injury protection on your auto insurance, please give us at TDA a call, 877-832-6690, or on the web at tdanow.com.